four freedoms and a four decade wait. Hi everybody, Tim Minton with your Buzz 60. Franklin Roosevelt Four Freedoms Park has finally been dedicated 38 years after the death of the architect who designed it. Already appraised by the New York Times as a new spiritual heart of the city, the park appropriately sits on Roosevelt Island right across the water from the United Nations, a term first used by President Roosevelt. Opened by President Clinton and New York leaders, the park celebrates freedoms from fear and wanting and the freedoms of expression and worship. A new nearby Cornell University Science Center will bring thousands of regular visitors when it opens in a few years. There'll be a short walk from a Roosevelt monument and polished walls that characterize the new park. But good luck to the scientists trying to figure out how plans for a park survived six mayors and six governors in a city where plans can change in a New York minute. Buzz 60, now you know, pass it on.